Aquarius and welcome to your weekly tarot forecast. This is for September 30th through October 6th, 2019. I'm going to start by pulling a card to see overall energy Aquarius. So let's see what's coming out for all of you guys this week. Woo, we have power and I kind of had a feeling, I was like, ooh, I'm feeling Archangel Michael again. But Aquarius, um, the other card in this deck that was reminding me of Archangel Michael and letting me know that his presence is with the person I'm reading for did not is different than this one, okay? You guys are the only one that's received this one. Power. You have the sword of power handed to you this week, Aquarius. You have the vibes, like the angelic realm is backing you. Speak your truth cut through the BS where it needs to be cut through. Nothing is meant to hold you back or stand in your way this week whatsoever, Aquarius. You are so empowered. Archangel Michael with you, protecting you, showing you the truth, encouraging you to speak your truth, and giving you that sword of protection and power to cut through every obstacle and protect yourself from any adversity that may be coming your way. So let's pull some tarot, Aquarius, and uh, see why Mr. Archangel Michael is with you so strong. I, I Honestly, um, he's come out in two other readings in um, Cancer and Scorpio. So if you have a moon in Scorpio rising, or moon rising in Cancer or Scorpio, or heavy placement in your natal chart in either one of those signs, highly recommend um, watching those readings. But Aquarius, I just have to say, this energy feels so much stronger coming through in your guys' reading than it did in Cancer or Scorpio. So let's see what this is all about. Ace of Pentacles. It is time for you to get yours, Aquarius. Two of Pentacles. Very interesting, though. Some of you may have a decision you need to make that you've been kind of holding back on. The Magician, you are magic this week. Very powerful. Forces of nature on your side. Yeah, King of Swords. It doesn't get better than that. That is your energy. And whether you are male or female, okay, um, coming through as the King of Swords, to me, that's your uh, solar plexus chakra. And that's letting me know that you are very, very empowered this week, Aquarius. And, you know, your mind is everything. Let nobody sway you or try to tell you what's good for you or what you should do, blah, blah, blah. No, Aquarius, you are on the path of success. The angels are backing you, are behind you, are leading the way. And any decision that you have to make this week, it needs to be what is best for you. Okay? And wow, now we have the King of Pentacles. Um, this could involve an earth sign, Taurus, uh, Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. But Aquarius, um, more than that, because we have this Ace of Pentacles and then the King of Pentacles, this decision that some of you are facing is for about your own longevity, um, where you may be like you may have a business um, or you may be a manager or supervisor and you're interviewing and it's between two people here. And Aquarius, you know what I would say, um, you know, it could be a fellow air sign or earth sign, but the one that you feel is most like you is the person that you should choose, okay? Just because this King of Swords, he's yielding that sword, and then here, you know, Archangel Michael with the Sword of Power, I just feel that the person who's most like you or is an air sign is the one that you should hire, okay? If that is how this is speaking to you. Because I see a choice, and it's really down to like two people, or this could be where you're trying to decide um, you know, the rationality of your mind opposed to, um, like what's, it could be like what you're thinking and feeling inside doesn't seem very logical. Okay. But that's what you should go with over reality. And I would normal like, you know, I don't say to go do stupid, stupid things. What I mean is what didn't work out for others doesn't necessarily mean it's not going to work for you, okay? Because you are very empowered this week and you have the ability, the magic, the sword 
to break through anything that's holding you back. So what didn't work for others, Aquarius, that's on them. That's about their path, their karma, their journey. It does not mean that it won't work for you, okay? So just keep that in mind and in perspective those of you that have like this decision to make others of you if we've been in a struggle financially like kind of struggling to make ends meet with this ace of pentacles and this king of pentacles aquarius there could be an offer coming your way or there could finally be the help the resources the abundance and approval on a loan of some kind it's just like whatever you need this week is going to come your way very positive return of energy for Aquarius. I love this ace here. And then you have those two kings and the magician. The only card that's kind of eh is right here, this two of pentacles. And that's either about some sort of decision or um, not enough abundance or resources. And you've been kind of balancing like a juggling act. But this week, that all changes. So let's pull, ooh, let's pull some more cards. Okay, those three wanted to come out. To clarify, okay, what do we have here? So we have the Hanged Man, Ten of Wands, Page of Wands, King of Cups. Wow, you've got three kings going on, and Six of Wands. Wow. Okay, Aquarius, um, with these three kings, you know, it reminds me of the three wise men. There is something very special and magical going on in your reality this week, in your world. Um, with these three kings, the magician and Archangel Michael. So, Aquarius, um, if you are interviewing for a job to get a new job... I really feel like there's three people that are going to be super impressed with you because with the Six of Wands sitting with these three kings, that's the spotlight, that's honor, that's recognition, that's reward, that's victory, Aquarius, and that's what's coming to you. And it has something to do with these three kings. These could be literal people or this could be just different energies around you. Speaking of the angels, all right, because this here could also be Archangel Michael. Um, I don't know all the archangels with all the different cards in the deck, but for me personally, um, the sword is always my symbol of Archangel Michael, and I see that. So whatever is unfolding this week, Aquarius, please know you are protected. The angels are with you. The spirit of the three wise men with you. Kings on your side, having your back. You really standing out in the spotlight, being noticed, being honored, being recognized, being rewarded. And this comes after a long journey through this Ten of Wands. Um, hanged man feeling very blocked, stuck, like you had so much to sacrifice, and now that he has this Ace of Pentacles, so where we were stuck, where we were blocked, where we were sacrificing, that energy shifts into this Ace of Pentacles, the door opening, the opportunity, the abundance coming in, um, you cutting through any BS or restrictions, barriers that were holding you back. Um, the end of a long journey where we're juggling between two things or really trying to make a decision, like that comes to an end this week and you make your decision. And Aquarius, um, with the Page of Wands, you know, if you guys are it, like looking for a job, I feel this week is like so prime. So even if you are currently employed but you hate where you work, this would be a great week to put your resume out there or apply to different jobs, all right? Just with the way all the cards are aspected, highly favored for that. There's magic around you, your energy very intoxicating, inviting, stimulating to others. The three kings supporting you, having your back, whether in the physical or this is the spirits of the, you know, three wise men, all right, Aquarius, you've got that plus the angelic realm going on and being in the spotlight, the center of attention in a very, very positive way, Aquarius. So 
this is nice. Um, and nobody else has had a reading like this this week. So something is very special happening and taking place uh, this week for you guys. No question about that. So let's pull a card here to get an idea about specific blessings. A blessing on your wisdom. Aquarius, look at that. Yeah, you have the sword of power, the sword of truth, which has been handed to you by the angels, Archangel Michael, mainly, and um, Aquarius, it's like, how do I express this? There's blessing coming in through this Ace of Pentacles, okay, and everybody wants to know about the physical, the material of the blessing. But with this, um, your guides really want to talk about more than that because they've already brought this up. That you know there is some sort of shift, like you're finally going to make a decision, or where resources have been tight. You feel like you've been juggling. Like there's something changing for you, okay? But um, with this, a blessing on your wisdom, Aquarius. I feel like what you guys have been going through um, over the course of this last year, these last 10 months, or it could be much longer than that, but definitely over this last 10 months to a year, and it's like things don't feel fair, you feel stuck, you feel restricted, like nothing's going your way, all of that, Aquarius, honestly, every one of those experiences and challenges was shaping you and growing you in the soul space, in the mental body, in your emotional body, whether you realized it or not. And now this week, you know, the astrology, where you are on your life path, all of that, that is changing, that is shifting. And as you hold this, you know, sort of power, sort of truth in your hands, you know, you're also, you could never have it there if um, everything you have been going through ex didn't expand into wisdom and lessons learned. This is not where I'm a victim and life is unfair. No, this is where you have grown so strong and wise and resourceful from what you've been going through that now it's like the three kings, like you have been grown emotionally, mentally, and physically, and it's time for the manifestation of that, for the reward of that, to be in the spotlight, to be healed, to be heard. Okay, Aquarius? So this is a very powerful week for you guys. Let's pull some advice. Courage. Live your life fearlessly with courage, strength, and determination. Aquarius, uh, Archangel Michael is also about helping you have courage and strength to persevere and push through. And look at this is they these fell out, and this is the one that's on the top. Blue star. Follow the light of your inner compass, the blue star. It will lead you to the truth that resides within your soul. I mean, come on. That's pretty much, you know, what I said uh, right there with that card. There it is again. So Aquarius, you are being restored. You are growing into the wisdom and lessons that you've been going through. And the three uh, kings, the three wise men, there is something very significant about that for you guys, whether that's physical reality or that's the spirit realm um, of the three wise men plus Archangel Michael coming in. You are so supported and empowered um, and being encouraged to be brave and push forward. Trust your soul. Grab the magic because it is just being handed to you. Aquarius, a long journey coming to an end. So those are your messages for this week, Aquarius. I'm wishing you all the best. Take care.